these other kids. It's gorgeous, gorgeous. Welcome to the first time of me going into Whole Foods. If you missed my video of first time of me going into Trader's Joe, I'll put in recommendation. But I got good feedback from that and you wanted to see more of first times putting you in my bag and trying things out. So I said, let me try Whole Foods. In that video, I had around $26 or $28. I don't really remember. So I'm going to try to keep that same budget. It wasn't on purpose. Um, on my phone, I always write, um, I have like my ghostly list digital because I always forget something. So I go in without really looking, but I still look so I can keep track. And I don't have tomatoes. So that's something I could buy here. Well, I'm, I had now I'm going out. But I think I'm also going to look around and see if there's anything interesting and take it with me. I'm a little nervous because <laughs> I know people will be like, oh, it's so expensive. So we'll see. Or oh, I'll just stay a week without tomatoes. It's fine. Done it before. I'll do it again. Maybe I'm so sorry, maybe I'm not. But you can call me Rice because that's my nickname. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. And let's see what Whole Foods is about. First of all, there are different cards that is very good. I'm taking a small one. <laughs> I know, I, look, I keep bumping into everything. I'm like, what am I doing? <laughs> uh, no, I'm looking. I'm just curious. It looks good. <laughs> so I'm just looking. Thank you. Hi. Good morning. How are you? Good, thanks. Thank you. 
So many breads. My camera stopped working, so just in case this is backup footage. So nice. Bread. Passons, but they're yeah, expensive. I bought this one bread. I bought a salt and olive bread, and these are the cakes. What is gorgeous. And all the different types of cookies. My camera stopped filming in the middle of me grocery shopping and good thing because a lot of people talk to me and I don't like to film people without their knowledge. So that Whole Foods, this is the sum. Um, I got to, I asked permission to film um, the, the camera, the camera. I asked to take pictures of the cake and stuff. 24.35 is my total and I did good. I did similar to the Trader Joe's, but honestly, I prefer Whole Foods to Trader Joe's. And I've been believing people saying how expensive it is. It is expensive, okay? Beef for, um, for like $20, one slice, but I guess it's organic. I don't know that, okay? I started to see things that were super expensive. I did start, like even the cakes and stuff, but I did buy a cake, a $6 small one, a peach almond tart, so I'll see. Um, Y'all just see, that's the ingredients Whole Food Market. And the staff are so nice. Because that's the only thing. I was like nervous to film because every time someone's popping up, I was like, oh, they know I'm filming. I look guilty. But I'm filming only me. You're in a bag. But after a while, like people talking to me, it's good that the camera stopped. And if the camera didn't stop, I'll see in the footage. Because obviously people kept talking to me. And like, oh, a lady was like, oh, where are you from? Which is a question I get often. But she was mostly going, where are you from? And then she was like, oh, my daughter is in a foreign exchange program right now. She's in Italy, Florence, this and this and this. And I've been to Florence, but I didn't tell her all of that. <laughs> because I was like, okay. But again, the camera had stopped. So I was like, okay, I'll just let her, I'll just have a conversation. But every everyone was talking to me it was so nice. They had sales. I saved a dollar twenty six. I sorry, a dollar fifty six. I saved. So they had sales, and I took stuff on sale. Olive salt bread. Um, that was hot because I wanted whole wheat, but it was busy. But it's okay because I said I did take Trader Joe's bread, so I can taste that type of bread, and it's a whitish bread. Whereas Trader Joe, I also took a baguette. So I think it's fair to like compare since both were white bread, they do not have baguette. So I couldn't buy a baguette to compare. I think um, I did good. I'm glad. I was scared I was my good $30, even 50 with a few things. But when I was looking at it, I was saying, and the calamari on healthy food. And I didn't even buy the pot, like food already made in Trader Joe. And I could have buy fresh food, but the fresh food was expensive. So I got bread, salt, olive oil bread. I got one tomato, just one. Just one tomato. Just one. I got the almond, pear almond tart. This is in here. I cannot show you, but it looks fine. I got breaded calamari, the whole food brand. I'm gonna make this and hot up my chicken that I seasoned already. Should I have bought noodles or something instead? Yes, but it is what it is. I did not buy noodles. The noodles were more expensive. Like the food that was already seasoned and stuff, or ready to cook, were expensive. So I was like, okay i cook this i can do this i said do the noodles from scratch so i was like i didn't feel like doing it i got strawberries i looked at the strawberry that it's it's end season still spring and all of them still was looking thing but it was reasonably priced so i said the prices beforehand so i showed you so thank you for joining me on my first time to whole foods pleasantly surprised but also it's the hype i don't get it the thing is, Whole Foods is not close to me, so I don't think I'll do all this journey to just come here. But if ever I'm in the area, I think it's worth for me to stop here and just see what's on sale and just buy it. Because at least, you know, you're getting fresh stuff. And I didn't go deep, deep and then within each oil. I just went soup, soup, like I did Trader Joe's. Just a quick overview. But I also prefer here because I find the bread, the cakes, the cookies. They had like a bunch of types. It's not wild. It's like regular trader joe is more or uh, i feel for ready-made food not a not a this not a this just food that already made and this one is more of a mix like i bought the calamari process the process it is processed foods they already made it's in a freezer but there's also food that's seasoned like a guy was telling me oh he did like the chicken wings like that's his and i said oh look good it had jerk chicken wings that you can make if i had an air fryer or something i maybe would have took took those there was like other salmon season all of that but i was like one slice of season salmon 17. 
don't forget to like and subscribe it helps the channel enormously to let me know if there's a store or food you want me to try because i know some people like i'm in america said you need to try some junk food da -da 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 -da. i'm not so into fast food but if it's really really highly requested i might try fast food chains that i never tried yet here in the states just let me know but i'm not a ghostly store so i think i need to branch out to fast food so let me know tell me and until next time um in next video like and subscribe Bye.